Multnomah County Commissioners are talking about once again handing out tents and tarps to those experiencing homelessness. Yeah, they just paused the program four months ago following some sharp criticism and a lawsuit against the city. Uh, Fox News' Deborah Gill joins us now live. And Deb, it sounds like the debate got pretty heated. It did. Advocates for the homeless say tents and tarps are actually life-saving supplies when there isn't enough shelter beds and especially when weather turns severe. In June, Multnomah County commissioners decided to stop buying and handing out tents and tarps as a step to clean up the city and as they push to increase shelter beds. Well, a new proposal would resume the handouts during cold and severe weather, but discourage use of tents and tarps on sidewalks and limit Limit one per person. The discussion among commissioners became quite heated, with some commissioners arguing that the distribution of tents and tarps is the least the county can do, while others said it put a burden on taxpayers and the environment. The policy is is a bunch of words that kind of say nothing um, and don't give any guidance as to what to do. And we need to be accountable as a county to. Um, our uh, residents and our taxpayers and to the environmental impact of all of all of what's happening. I think that there are serious unintentional outcomes that we are not considering. I, in good conscience, do not believe it is compassionate uh, to to tell people as we go into winter that we are not going to provide you with a basic necessity of life. Commissioners also suggested that a threshold on getting people into housing be created and met before stopping distribution. And last year, the Joint Office of Homeless Services gave out more than 6,000 tents and 24,000 tarps to nonprofits, which then gave them to the homeless. But then during city cleanups of the homeless camps this last summer, the city got rid of them. Reporting live in Northwest Portland, Deborah Hill, Good Day, Oregon.